Reading research articles may be a different type of reading than you are used to. This tutorial will help you create a strategy for reading and understanding this type of information. Before you begin reading the article, look at its structure. Most research articles tend to have a formal structure and will have similar sections no matter their discipline or publisher. These sections might be labeled or you may have to infer what they are by their contents. These are the most common sections. Once you know what these sections are and the information they contain, you can decide which are the most important for your needs and what order you should read them in. You don't need to read the research articles like you would a novel for fun. From beginning to end, you can skip around. Let's look first at what information is in each of these sections. The abstract. The abstract is a summary of the article and may include an overview of the researcher's results. Sometimes, the article's title can be misleading, and the abstract can clarify whether the article really aligns with your topic. You may be able to read the abstract right from Forsyth Library or the database search page. The introduction. The introduction provides background information on the topic and will include the main idea, research question, or thesis for the paper. The introduction may also include, labeled or not, a literature review, which talks about what has already been written about on the topic in the field. The methods or methodology of the research. This is exactly how the researcher set up to test their hypothesis, case study, experiment, or trials. The results. This is the data and information collected and analyzed during the research. This is often illustrated with charts and graphs. The discussion. This section explains the meaning of the results and any limitations on the research. The conclusion. Not always labeled, this summarizes the important information learned from the research and may offer what steps researchers need to take next. Not all articles will have the exact same structure and labels, but taking a look at the paper's format will help you plan how to read and understand the article. Because once you identify the parts of the article, you can then rearrange your reading order so you read the most important parts first. Start with the most general parts of the research paper. The abstract, introduction, and conclusion will give you an overview of the information. Then, move on to the most detailed sections of the paper, the discussion, results, and methods. Remember, reading a research article is not like reading a book from cover to cover. You can read it in sections and skip around. If the article you're reading isn't an assigned reading for your class, and you realize the article is not useful for your purpose, stop reading and move on to another article. You can ask a librarian for help at any stage of the research process. We can help you search for articles to read, organize your information, connect you with the Writing Center to help you write and revise your work, and help you cite your sources correctly. Contact us today for help.